Okay, hello everyone. This is my video of my uh, R9 290, I guess, setup that is running really, really bad, and I'm having really bad um, performance um, or performance problems. I'm gonna go over my specs a little bit here. Uh, I, I have a uh, Intel Core i5 2500K um, uh, processor. Uh, clock that as you can see now it's uh, 4.6 and why it's taking back and forth it's just it's steep um, speed step is enabled um, and here you can see that I have the R9290 um, my temperatures are running okay right now I'm not doing anything with the computer I'm just uh, running it on um, just using the, my desktop or whatever uh, I'm gonna show you my U Engine Valley uh, benchmark uh, right here. As you can see, I I use the Extreme HD uh, preset, and as you can see, I have insanely low uh, both score uh, and average F FPS and av and minimum FPS and max FPS. Uh, as you can see, is here a uh, GPU model R1990. Um, and probably a lot of you are going to say uh, update your drivers and everything and I have done that, I did I did that today uh, I, I can see which driver version is running on 13.12 is the, is the newest one um, out there right now <clears throat> yeah and I will also show you some Battlefield 4 uh, FPS Um, so now, as you can see, uh, I I entered um, a game in um, uh, Battlefield 4. As you can see, my frame rate goes up and down, and I'm e only in uh, the start menu. As you can see, it's just 30. I'm getting 36 frames F <laughs> FPS just looking at the start menu. Um, as you can see, my uh, GPU core fr frequency is running uh, on pretty much 100% for uh, 947 megahertz. Uh, and GPU load is on 100, uh, and I put the fan speed on 50. Uh, the GPU temperature is not too high either; it's just running just below 80, which is nice. And as you can see, my uh, my um, processor is running as you can see a uh, 4.6 gigahertz um, and it's in turbo mode it, it's actually clocked to 4.5 it's running in uh, turbo mode as well and as you can see here is the fre frequency uh, of it I have 16 gigs of RAM as well so it's only 5.11 uh, that's using um, one of the cores is actually pretty high compared to others, but uh, as long as it isn't hitting the top, it is no problems at, at all. Uh, the CPU uh, temperatures are also fine, uh, uh, and um, well, let's just get into the game actually. Now I'm actually getting 61, 60 frames. Oh, I forgot to show you the settings I'm using as well. Um, Right now, I'm playing on Ultra, just the Ultra preset, just everything, and now... <laughs> oh, this is great as well. Um, Battlefield 4 has stopped working, it's in Swedish. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, that's kind of weird. But anyway... Yeah, let's try this again later, wait. Okay. <laughs> Sorry for that, and yeah, that's the first time Battlefield 4 has ever crashed. Um, so I joined uh, a new lobby, uh, but the same map. Um, as you can see here, I'm getting 38, 39, and now I died. Well, that's great. Um, but as you can see, my frame FPS is like seriously, seriously low, and I cannot figure out why. Um, try
try this again. So right now, as you can see, just just by looking, <laughs> I mean, I can't play the game. Pretty much, it's completely ruined. But I mean, looking up in the sky, I get you know, 130 frames, of course, 80 frames by looking in the ground. But just looking straight forward, you know, 46, 47. Hey, and as you can see, my, like I said before, is running on 100% pretty much GPU load. Um, see it here as well in the graph instead. Uh, and it's running at 81 degrees Celsius, so it's not running it's not hot either. And at the same time, um, my processor is running perfectly fine, no problem, at 70%, and everybody or all the cores are running just like they should do and the temperatures are not too high either um, and I don't know why I'm getting 46, 47 FPS in this game and this is only at, like I said, if you look at my settings um, this is with vSync off uh, and playing at 1080p, 60 hertz, and on board less actually. If you turn vertical sync on, it's probably gonna go even lower. That's on. Well, not really. It's gonna be pretty much the same. Um, the vertical sync usually reduces your FPS by quite a lot. Um, don't think that full screen is gonna make any any difference. It's pretty much the exact same thing. Um, yes. And yeah, same thing on full screen. Forty nine. Well, now we get fifty. But as you can see, under the fifty mark, just running forward is probably gonna use it even more. Um, Forty eight. Kind of hard. <laughs> doing it with one hand, but as you can see, I'm not getting any anything higher than that. But um, I have pretty much done a everything that I can with my computer to to um, make it work. I have um, reinstalled Windows, not not because of this, but because I moved to a uh, moved my sister to an SSD instead. Um, I have unparked my my cores. Um, I have overclocked my processor. Uh, I have um, also done a mem test on my RAM memory. I have um, also made sure that I installed Battlefield 4 and Orig Origin in program files and not program files 86 because. I read on the forum that it's going to run the 32-bit version, and like I said, I made sure it's running on the on the 64, or yeah, the 64-bit version. Um, and it's not because, as you can see, I have two screens, two displays, uh, and it's not because of that. Because before, when I, I I usually only play on the screen here, which is 1080p, but I'm thinking of ordering a four, uh, 14 by 40. Um, but as you can see, it's horrible FPS. But anyway, um, removing that monitor would not increase my FPS anyway, um, because displaying this—I mean, it's—it's <laughs> it's not. I mean, any any way close to displaying this, or you know, whatever. Um, so, yeah, I have pretty much tried everything, but I'm. I don't know why it is uh, it, it's doing this. Um, I I don't know. Maybe I should go for a refund or something. Maybe my card is faulty or something. Because I don't think. I mean, I paid around three thousand five hundred crowns for this, which I think is about five hundred dollars for this card. Um, which is just. I mean, paying that price for something like this is just horrible. But anyway, thank you for watching. Goodbye.